Ah, some fresh air. It has been 62 degrees for the past two days, and uh, I'm digging it. This weather brings us to Walmart. This is a Walmart I don't normally go to. I'm excited to see what they got inside. New breed of steelbooks out here today, and that is the glow in the dark steelbooks. Walmart's supposed to have them. Hopefully, Walmart at least put them out. Glow in the dark. Did you understand that? Glow in the dark. How cool was that? Snap, crackle, and pop. We have found the new releases. Found the Wonka sign that says new but there seems to be no wonka but oh yo, look at this glow in the dark <laughs> except they had the steel bulks think they're all gone of course they got all the slip covers but they don't have the steel bulks got some nice slips though and i do like that especially this twister don't think i have a twister on blu-ray with a slip cover i'm definitely Picking this bad boy up. It's on Blu-ray. I think all the rest are DVDs. Love the blue. Blue's my favorite color. We have Terminator and Keanu Reeves. Two of my favorite things right there. I already got that slip cover before, but this one's glow in the dark. And they got the endoskeleton that could glow in the dark. You guys are like, I get it, Dave. It's glow in the dark. We understand. I'm just saying this is pretty sweet though. And look at this. They even have Terminator, the Sarah Connor Chronicles with the big box set. I've never seen the show. Could be tempting. For 20 bucks, they got Batman, four film collection, Final Destination, the thing. Dragonheart slip cover. That. That is very nice. That is a cool looking dragon right there. If I do say so myself, and I do say so. Blade has four films? What was the fourth one? Oh, okay. Well, there's uh, there's that. And then Renfield. I've seen it. It's not bad. Do I need it in glow in the dark? Maybe. Just thinks they didn't have the steel books. What can you do? Don't worry, we're gonna try another Walmart. And that's another thing. They don't have Wonka over there. Actually, please forgive me, they do. One DVD copy. All right, there's multiple DVD copies. It's got no slit. Uh, this is not the one I was looking for. And there's that on DVD. There's no 4K or the steel book. This came out, uh, what is this? Migration on DVD collector's edition. That means everyone's gonna collect it. If you're a true collector, you will get this. You know what this is about. There's a lot of rubber ducks. I'm intrigued and I kind of want it. I'm not, I'm not going to pay 20 bucks for that right now. Or if it was $3. What is this though? Ben Affleck with a new movie? Hypnotic? Never even heard of this. When did this, when did he make this? Recent? It's got a photograph. Look at this photograph. Every time I hear it makes me laugh. Ooh, look at this. They even got the marbles with the 4K steel book. One copy. One steel book left at this Walmart. Do I get it? Is it worth it? Like the artwork is, it's okay. Don't know if I really need this. It, plus it's the Marvels. So in that case, I'm probably gonna get it. That's not true, okay. <laughs> this is going back in its spot right there. But let's see what we got over here. Just there and there. Well, G. Wilkers, look at this. Walk hard with John C. Riley with a steel bulk, baby. That is a nice looking steel bulk. I didn't know this was coming out as well. So this is pretty nice. I dig that a lot. Dewey Cox story. All right, no legend is bigger. It's pretty cool. That's going for 34. No, that says T. &T. I'm looking at the wrong one. The one next to it. There we go, Dave. $20. I think this is just a regular Blu-ray. We'll still take it. I'm going to hold on to it. You got more of the Hunger Games set. And I think I'm gonna still pass on those, especially for $60. This new movie right here, The Moon. We went to the moon in 1969. Not 1968, but a year later. You guys have seen Even Stevens? You'll understand a reference. It's a very nice slipcover. It reminds me of Gravity, which I love. I love Gravity. Now let me know in the comments if you guys have seen this or not. I'm intrigued. Let me know in the comments if this is any good. There we go, that is something new. Next goal wins that looks different but there's no slip cover <laughs> and it's in a case how good is this movie if it gets a protective case i don't know but jungle pops kind of deserves it as well i'm surprised these aren't flying off the shelves what is this <laughs> alice in terrorland that that's fascinating oh my god i kind of dig it i'm not gonna lie and i might hold on to this that's pretty much all they had in the blu-ray section been four titles steelbook blu-ray a couple dvds i was just checking out the uh, the neca section and oh my goodness we got ninja turtles 3 action figures oh no even though this movie is terrible it's still ninja turtle figures double pack this is beautiful. I love it. <laughs> this is very tempting. Oh, they even got the masks. All right, I don't know what to do, guys. Might hold off on this Matrix now. Definitely gonna get the Steel Book. Alice in Terrorland, I feel like I need that. And of course, Twister. I decided to put the Alice in Terrorland away. I was like, I don't really need it right now. Look at this bad boy. 
Go Ninja, go Ninja, go! I made another funny. It's great. Was not expecting this whatsoever. Um, I just had to. I'm a big Ninja Turtles fan. It's worth it. It is freaking worth it because they're beautiful. We're not done. We're going to try another Walmart, see if they got the steel books. Enough chit chat. Let's do it. Move, you idiot. Get out of the way. No, no, no. You got to be kidding me. No, I killed the predator. That's right. I was the Terminator. And I, I saved the human race. And I got the Jamie, the Turbo Man doll. What do I have to do to get to buy these people? No, no, no. You have to wait. You have to wait over there. You have to wait right here when it turns red. What kind of bullshit is that? Come on. There it is. Walmart. Oh, I think I see them. They're right there. <laughs> Let's go. We have found the glow in the dark steelbooks, y'all. They all have one copy too. Just one copy hanging around. This is fantastic. Let's freaking go. We have Fast X, we have Battlestar Galactica, Dune, and Godzilla vs. Kong, which I shall be grabbing. I don't have Dune, and I know the new one's coming out. This one would be a good time to get it, you know, because it's going to dark. I want to ask Walmart to shut off the lights. That's what I want to do right now, to prove that these things work. But right now, I just gotta take the word for it. I was kind of tempted with the Fast X as well. I don't know. I don't have Dune, but I also don't have Fast X. I feel like I would enjoy Fast X over Dune, but I like that artwork better than Fast X. Oh, man. I don't know what to do, man. I don't know what to do. They're both tempting. I'm definitely not getting that one, so sorry. So, I don't know. I might hold on to Dune for now. Glad that we came to this Walmart, and I got the last one, so let's freaking go well let's go see what they have for the new releases and they do have wonka they got the 4k right here they got the blu-ray and of course the dvd the no steelbook um i don't know if they even have a spot for it saw it online i don't know if it's just only being sold online because i don't see a spot for that steelbook we do got the 4k and there's only one 4k left and there's a nice 4k slit a nice shine to it a nice glare but but do i need it that's the thing. You no, know I'm gonna take the gamble. I'm gonna take the gamble. I already spent too much. I don't need this guy on my plate as well, but they do have it here at this Walmart, along with the Blu-ray slipcover and that DVD. Migration with the Blu-ray this time. The other one had the DVD, but we got the Blu-ray. No 4K, no, no lenticular steelbook for this guy. Is that John Cena? I think I see him. Shit, he's gone. Where do you go? Damn it. I swore he was in the, in the, uh, what is this? The Independent? I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just gonna carry on now. They don't have the Marvels. Uh, they got the DVD, but they don't have the Steelbook. That's okay, I'm not gonna cry about that. That is what we got. And then once again, we have to see what we have in the Blu-ray section. Oh, check this out. They have the VHS 85. I love these movies. Even though they can get pretty ridiculous and insane, I still have a good time with them. I might hold it off because I'm not too sure if they might have a Blu-ray for it. I really wanna watch it now. Absolute blast of gore, laughs, fright, and mayhem. God damn it, <laughs> now I wanna watch it. It's only $10, which is not a bad deal, which is not a bad deal whatsoever. They're entertaining as hell. God damn it, all right, I'm gonna, it's, it's going in the pile. <laughs> Dream scenario with Nicolas Cage on a Blu-ray with that slipcover. <laughs> Look at his face, it's just pure comedy gold. Uh, so yeah, dream scenario, never heard of it, but there you go, there's a Nicolas Cage title. Is there anything else here that we need? I think that's about it, to be honest with you. This Alice, this Alice in Terrorland, it's back. Put it away. <sighs> next week, I'll get it next week. This Walmart turned out to be really good. I love it. The new breed of Steelbooks, the glow in the dark. I, I want them to make more. I need them to make more. I want them. And the other slipcovers I didn't see at the other Walmart was the Equalizer 3 movie collection. This one looks really nice as well, along with Spider-Man. Spider-Verse 2 movie collection. That looks pretty nice as well. Overall, these are nice slipcovers. And I don't have Equalizer. No, I can't, <laughs> I can't keep buying, okay? I gotta put something back. All right, guys, I was at the front of the line checking out and the, the lines are insane. I'm gonna put these back, <laughs> but I'm gonna hide them. Long ass lines and it's just, I can hold off. I can hold off for now. I'm gonna hide them. Um, I, need a good, I need a good spot though. So it saves me money. I already spent too much and uh, I'll just grab them next week. Let's check out what I bought. I also got fan mail so we can do that as well. Yeah, I showed you guys the Ninja Turtles once again. Just look at that. Go Ninja, go Ninja, go! I didn't see it at this Walmart, but look at this. Walk, walk hard, walk hard, baby. John C. Riley, so that is pretty cool. I do dig that artwork on the Steelbook. Step Brothers, man. 
Hey, D hey, Dale, Dale, no power tools. That's what we need. We need a Step Brothers steel bolt. Give that to me. I want it now. I want it now. I want it to glow in the dark. <laughs> we'll take that for show. For show. Here we go. That was the steel bolt. We got the Blu-ray with a slip cover. It's pretty nice. Twister Man, iconic with Bill Paxton. It's game over, man. Game over. R.I.P. He is a legend. He is a legend. I love this movie, and the new one's coming out. So this is pretty cool. Slip cover and a, a nice glow touch to it. So I'm really happy that they did that because this movie is a classic in the suck zone. Look what you got right here in front of you. What are you trying to say? You got me, Joe. <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, this is what I got on Blu-ray. Worry, we got fan mail right here as well. This box going on. Oh, no, I don't know who this was sent by. Oh, what is this? Oh. <laughs> Yo, look at this. Arnold Schwarzenegger won those golden books. Look at the, look at the bicep right there in the cartoon form. It's great. I don't see a note or anything. I don't know who sent this to me, but thank you so much. This is beautiful. Gotta check this thing out. <laughs> well, let me let me read. <clears throat> I got the milk from a local farm. Carry in heavy loads of firewood and do sit-ups all before breakfast. Yeah. This is incredible. It tells Arnold's entire true story. Jim and everything. And he's got the tank right there because he blow things up. Look at those pecs, man. Look at those pecs. This is incredible. <laughs> so this is going, this is definitely going in the Arnold exhibit. Whoever sent this to me, thank you so much. This means a lot. And of course, you get a hug. Come here. Come here. Give me a hug. I'm gonna open up one more. I'm gonna open this package up. The last one I got a Michael Myers shirt. Which one? Oh, oh, that's a Chucky. A Chucky t-shirt. Look at this bad boy. Child's Play 2? Yep, Child's Play 2. Hi, I'm Chucky. I'm your friend to the end. This to the end, remember? This is the end, friend. Even though that's in the first one, I still want to say it. Child's Play 2, one of my favorite horror movies of all time, and I got right here on a t-shirt. That is beautiful. Thank you so much, whoever sent that. We'll cherish this thing, I'll wear it, I'll embrace it, I'll smell it, lick it. Maybe, maybe I'll do that. <laughs> but thank you so much for sending me this. I love Chucky, Child's my favorite. Come here, you get a hug as well. Come here. Urgh. Thank you. I found a lot of things today, so I thought I did good with my wallet. I thought I behaved a little bit, for the most part. Held back a little bit. And I'm proud of myself. Well, what'd you guys pick up for this week? Let me know. Did you get in those glow in the dark slips or steel books? I'll see you guys next time. Stay safe, stay in trouble. I'll see you next time. That's right. Remember the golden target or well, whatever they got this? It uh, get this book of me right there. Look at the, once again, just look at the biceps in the ocean. I always do this every day. Of course, Monday through Tuesday, you know, because it's great. <laughs> yeah. And uh, yeah, read it. Read it to your children, to, to your grandma. I don't care. Just read it.